Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back. We're looking at question 14 on the 2017 Fermat paper. And what have we got here? The expression 1 plus a half times 1 plus a third times 1 plus a quarter all the way up to times 1 plus a ninth is equal to. Okay, now the way we don't want to do this question is grab our calculator and say, okay, 1 plus a half times 1 plus a third, and so on. We don't want to do that. Okay, that's going to actually end up taking us way too long on this question. Let me show you what we can do just by simplifying the fractions here. Okay, so we have 1 plus a half, 1 plus a third, 1 plus a fifth, 1 plus 1 sixth, 1, oops, add an extra plus sign in there, 1 plus a seventh, 1 plus an eighth, and 1 plus a ninth. Okay, yes, it took me a while to write it out, and actually the solution is a lot faster than how long it took me to write it out, but I write it out for you guys. What's 1 plus a half? Why, it's 2 over 2 plus 1 over 2. It's going to be 3 halves. This is going to be three, uh, four, uh, 4 thirds. And this is going to be 5 fourths, 6 fifths, 7 sixths, 8 sevenths, and 9 eighths, and 10 ninths. Okay, yeah, you simplified the uh, fractions, but what can we do? When you multiply fractions, we can get all these things to cancel. This is something called a telescoping series, or I guess in this case a telescoping product, because it's sort of collapses in and just the two end parts really matter and so we get 10 over 2 is going to be our answer everything else cancels but of course 10 over 2 is just 5. so we look is 5 one of our possibilities sure it is it's a so there we go and that wraps up question 14 rather nicely join me in the next video of course for question 15 i'll see you guys there